Hi, I'm Toshi Maeda, and welcome back to JStories, where ideas and technology from Japan help solve global social and environmental problems. Here's a quick look at this week's JStories. Most people think of public toilets as dark, dingy, and dirty. But the Tokyo Toilet Project wants to change that with striking new toilets created by world famous Japanese architects and designers. For example, Shigeru Ban designed two toilets that feature special glass. When there's no one inside, the glass is transparent. But when there is somebody inside, the door turns cloudy. And fellow architect Kengo Kuma has designed a toilet village. Featuring five wooden huts, he imagined the village as a place for a pleasant stroll or even a romantic meeting spot for lovers. In total, 17 toilets are planned, of which 13 have already been built. And they are rapidly becoming Tokyo tourist attractions. Truly a toilet revolution. An innovative farm has opened on a roof of a Tokyo cafe that helps people with disabilities find work. But while the farm is groundbreaking, no ground is actually broken because it uses aquaponics, farming fish and growing plants in water. Aquaponics is kind to the environment and easy to set up in small urban spaces. And because it is suitable for automated farm management systems, it is easier to employ elderly people and those with disabilities. The government calls this bringing welfare and agriculture together. It could be an important way to protect the future of farming in Japan. Agrico Farm provides disabled people with farming experience, then helps match them with potential employers. Meanwhile, the delicious fish and herbs they nurture on the rooftop farm are already being enjoyed by customers at the first floor cafe. That's all for this week from JStories. Please visit our website at jstories.media for more details on these stories. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for more solutions and inspiration from Japan.